Hey everybody, welcome back. It's May 8th. Um, judging by how this is going, I might actually record all the way to the 10th in a single day. Oh, I'm not on the train. Oh, that's because, like, they're doing all this, like, tech stuff. I was like, wait, where am I? I think they moved my model to, um, the seat, which is a little bit further that? over, so I wouldn't be in the shot. Hey, that calling card sent you to the Madurama, uh, sent to the Madurama exhibit. Do you think? I was wondering about that. Yeah, I think it's just like the one set, uh, sent to Kamoshida. Ah, uh, it's nice to see the, the rumor loving going transferred transfer it over here from, a uh, um, from Inaba. People online are saying this fan of these are behind well, us. Well, that's not good. There's already a fan site with a bunch of requests posted on it. <laughs> it's <laughs> so cool. Can't believe there are real life superheroes. This happened twice. It's probably gonna happen again. Can't wait to see who's next. Yeah, vigilante justice. My gosh, my audio went back up. Keep doing that. All right. So you have your social studies trip tomorrow. It's a good chance um, to think about your future. Be be sure you're paying attention. Better not make a ruckus. Am I clear? I'll reflect poorly on our school. There's a group going to the television studio this year, correct? Kurosu, here's a question for you. What's the answer? With the advent of the color TV, something else started appearing in color. Do you know what it is? Well, movies, but I think actually movies were in color before TV was in color. I don't know how valid exactly. this is, actually. Exactly. For most people, um, most people's dreams were actually in black and white. But research shows that once color broadcasts were the norm, dreams started being mostly in color. It's fascinating. Um, what's fascinating is that people see the world in color regardless of TV's existence. It's strange that our dreams have been in black and white t until TV's inception. Okay, so I think... Uh, the reason for this is that most of people's like knowledge about the world it was in black and white because of them seeing in movies and television and once those started coming in color um, their vision of the world started being in those colors that they were seeing so it's possible but it feels kind of odd that it's like it's like where it's like people are like suddenly my dreams are now in color it's like you were dreaming in black and white yeah So uh, I'm not sure how valid that uh that look is, but ooh, oh, that was gonna get um right. knowledge up. In the future, if 3D television become normal and it lets us sense flavor and smell and heat, then dreams might become indistinguishable from reality. That's incredible. Huh? Dreams with flavor. I could get behind that. Eh, some people with more. Um, violent dreams would probably not like that. <laughs> hey, hey. Sounds like the principal trying to get info on the students. Why do you think he's doing that? Probably because Mr. Kamashita, right? Considering what happened to um, Suzuki san. Mm -hmm. I heard Principal Paka uh, Kobayakawa knew about the sexual harassment too. Just trying to blind an eye to it. Bet he wants to snuff out any rumors now. Even the volleyball team has been told to keep quiet. Unbelievable. Oh, that's just worse. So, what's he using Nishima Senpai for? Huh? Oh yeah, rumor is it that she knew as well. Isn't that horrible? She acts all noble about it too. Nishima Senpai knew? I'm so angry, I'm not even gonna get a soda. <sighs> What's the meaning of this, Principal Kobayakawa? Why did you post that notice? It was for your sake. I thought the more information you had, the easier your investigation would become. And did any information arise about the case I asked you to look into? <sighs> Nothing yet. I will pass the details along if anything comes up. Right now, there are more pressing issues. There's a more pressing issue. 
It appears some, um, there are students at Shujin who are being threatened by a criminal organization. What? What? Yeah, just like he said. Oh, I can't... I can't play him going, what? A student who saw your posting came to us looking for help. I'd like to request a countermeasure. Uh, isn't this some sort of mistake? I can't believe that this would happen to students at our academy. Now is no time for such concern. There are still lingering concerns regarding the Phantom Thieves. We need to catch people that make us look bad, not actually defend students. <laughs> the heck, dude. No, but... but we received a request for help. I'm rather busy at the moment. If you wish to do something, you need to act on your own. What? Sir. Are you sure about this? I'm still investigating your case as well. Yes, it, that's correct. It works, it works out perfectly. My intentions are born, uh, born fruit. This criminal investigation mu uh, must, be connecting a, must be a connecting factor. If you pursue this criminal issue, it'll surely find clues about the Phantom Thieves. But that's absurd. So let's say this rumor is true. Do you intend to ignore those students in trouble? Sir, I think you're ignoring those students in trouble. Your sister would have solved this easily if she was in your position. Whoops. Circle. My expectations are very high. I hope you don't disappoint. Hmm. So, what kind of person would be a bigger target than Madarama? Hmm. I wonder. I guess it would... I guess it'd have to be someone who's the talk of the town. That's quite a vague prerequisite. Don't we have any more specific ideas? Um... We went after a famous celebrity and we're eventually gonna go after an evil overlord, so we might as well go after a crooked politician. Ah, uh, yes, that would be an interesting line of thought. Either way, we'll need a lead before we can begin anything. Well, we'll just have to look uh, f uh, look for that as we go. If, there's only, if there was only a big target just lying around for us, like stealing from kids and doing evil things in the background that we've been slowly paying attention to. Mementos, I know... I know we have to go to Mementos, but we can't do that until I actually start doing social links with you. Okay. So... Oh! Uh, we're gonna be doing, um, some stuff with, um... We're gonna be doing stuff with, um, Sojuro today. Um, oh. Hmm... Uh, go to the police and the teachers are no good either. All this left is to counsel. What should I do? Well, don't worry, dude. Um... I said we can't just barge in there and talk to Mijima. Uh, let's just read the book. We don't, have much, we don't have much else to do today. The X, Y, and Z's of applying the pickup techniques keep uh, keep looking smooth even if you drop the ball. Mm. Picture of the offer swung and irritates me. Ow. Oh. So you finished reading it. It's just a sleazy book about picking up girls, but did have some good tips on being charming. Oh. Nope. Thought it was the right. different sparkles. Wanna head back? Yes, yeah, I home. By the way, there was absolutely no reason to ever study in the library. Because ah, you because you don't get a bonus for doing it, and if you study at the at the diner, you get food and you get a bonus. You know we're going to the TV station tomorrow, yeah? I'm thinking we might find our next target there. Oh, that's right. You always hear about how celebrities are involved in all sorts of shady business. 
Oh, yeah. With that much money, they're they probably got their fingers in all sorts of dirty business. Hmm. That phrasing has quite the immoral ring to it. Dude, I always react to the weirdest stuff. Anyways, we get to observe a live recording of a show, right? Ooh, maybe we're gonna be on TV. We'll just be in the crowd, remember? Any TV appearance would be like for two seconds. Try not to pull any fanciful stunts to garner re uh, attention, okay? You got time right now? Cafe's um, open a little while longer. What will you do? Next time. Oh, fine then. How about when you have time? Hmm? I've been getting a lot of spam mail lately. I've been getting information. Remember the cyber attack? Tens of thousands of people's personal information was leaked. Oh right, I heard about those hackers. I hear they've been causing damage around the world. They act like they're fighting an unjust system, but they're they're just still just a problem to people like us. Thank you, the curry was delicious. Sometimes you have to talk to them multiple times. On Discovery, Town Detectives, we talk about the Motomaki Chinatown, um, Motomaki Chinatown, a popular attraction for foodies. So many Chinese restaurants, yes, high quality Chinese uh, food is true perfection. Good smells are coming from all over the place, it's easy, it's easy to find something great to eat there. Uh, a little bit of information, um, most Asian food that you get in America is not actually Asian food. Like, this is probably a shocker to a lot of people. Not sure why, but um, they usually put a lot more salt and sugar into their foods because Americans are more used to salt and sugar being in their foods. You know what's funny? I could literally cosplay as this right now. <laughs> like, I, I just wish I had like slightly curly hair. I could literally just pull this off. I would just need a red belt. Like, it's funny. Like, maybe that sweet man purse <laughs> but it's like hey uh let's make coffee let's I can't tell you. anything else no not really mostly just hey. brewing coffee Ooh. because it's a lot better than hanging out with sojuro getting like two points that way or you brew coffee you get an item and then you get two points that way Another piece of coffee. <laughs> oh, looks like you're at it again. I'll have a sip. Mm. This flavor. Cuban Crystal Mountain, right? Let me explain. Cuba is the biggest island in the um in the Caribbean. Their coffee is known for its full um, full bodied aroma and taste. Crystal Mountain coffee is made from only the largest beans of the harvest. It has a sweet, nutty flavor with low acidity. Ah, <sighs> oh, the flavor profile's bland. Although I see you're preparing the cup the way I taught you, I'll, I'll acknowledge your hard work. <sighs> Keep mentoring you, so continue. One day there will be a flavor of coffee that only you can produce. You have potential. Keep training. See you guys tomorrow.